So hello guys, if some of you have been on my channel for a while, you'll know that I made a video about this before. It was called, When Jugger Nuggets and Kid Behind the Camera are fake channels. And they are fake channels. And I still think they're fake channels. And you know what, I've gotten a lot of heat for this. I've gotten so much heat that people are just leaving negative comments. And you know what, I don't give a fuck. I, I, I um, encourage you to go watch my video that's called I Don't Care because I really don't care about your hate comments. The other day I got in a battle with somebody that's like, why are you wearing a toque? Why are you wearing a hat? And <laughs> it got into a big argument about him bitching me out and it just led nowhere. I'm like, I don't give a fuck, really. I don't give a fuck. And he's like, if you don't give a fuck, why are you commenting? I'm like, well, you commented on me. I'm just answering your comment. Isn't that how it works? That shut him up. But anyways, I don't I don't care about the, the hate. So that video is kind of popular. I think it's got 6,000 views. Six, or maybe 11. Does that have 11,000? No, I think it has 6,000 views. Go back and watch it. But in the video, I was explaining that the kid behind the camera channel and the majority of his channel is fake. It's fake as shit. Um, yeah, kid behind the camera does a lot of vlogs. A lot of vlogs. But it's what he says in his vlogs that, that it's fake, okay? Um, okay, let me, let me, let's look at this. He does a lot of vlogs. The vlogs themselves are not fake because he physically has to pick up a camera and record. I get that. That part of it's not fake. But what he says and does in the vlogs is fake, all right? Bridget and Michael do not have jobs. You could say that they're living off of their YouTube income, but they also like to play off, just like Jesse, that they don't have money. And that's a bunch of bullshit because his dad, and we'll, we'll get to that in a second, his dad breaks a lot of shit. Smashes TV, smashes furniture, you know, breaks Michael's consoles and all this shit. Break, breaks his bed and all, like I said, furniture and all this shit. What does Michael do? He goes and pays it for it, gets his dad new tables, gets his dad new TVs, new computers. So really, if you don't have money, how can you afford all this shit? Now, I know, I know they've said that they're doing better than when they used to live in their trailer wood, or trailer park, what was it called? I don't know, it was called Trailwood or something? When they used to live in Trailwood, in that trailer park there. Their trailer was pretty, pretty run down. Uh, I know they're doing better now, but they still want to say that they don't have a lot of money. But we know that Kippy on the Camera makes a lot of money off YouTube. We know the Anchor Grandpa Show makes a lot of money off YouTube. And it doesn't stop there. They have Grandpa's Corner, and they have some other channel too. I, I don't know if they're run by them, but... I think they are. So they're making money off of at least three channels. I think they have a lot of money. There's also stuff that happens on the Anka Grandpa show. And that show, or that channel, is obviously fake as well. And if you think it's real, well you gotta go to the hospital and get your brain checked because it's not. It's, it's, it's fake. Okay? I'm pretty sure that Anka Grandpa and Michael sit at a table and they discuss what Grandpa should freak out on next. They discuss what would make a good video um, because a lot of the Anchor Grandpa stuff is starting to look really fake. Maybe it was a little bit real in the beginning, but now it's starting to look really fake. And it's looking, it's looking uh, a lot similar to what happens on Jesse's channel. So. Yes, okay, we know, Jesse's channel's still fake, Keep You On The Camera, still fake, Anchor Grandpa Show, obviously, fake, alright? I like Anchor Grandpa Show, I like Pentakonaka's Psycho Dad shit, I don't like Jesse in himself, but I do like Anchor Grandpa, but they, they don't say, Anchor Grandpa and Michael, they never come out and said that they do this for entertainment, they want to try to trick us into thinking it's real when it's not. And like I said, a lot of stuff that happens on the Anki Grandpa show is really similar to what's been happening on Jesse's channel, the Psycho Dad shit. Let's discuss a little some things that are similar. So some things that can that are similar to both channels. They're both dads. Psycho Dad, Anki Grandpa. Now you're probably thinking, well, 
that's pretty obvious. They're going to have dads, right? Okay, yes, um, one's older, one's a little bit younger. Um, but they both hate their sons. They're both always break their shit. Okay, let's look at it. Anchor Grandpa lived out in the backyard in a tent. Jesse lived out in the backyard in a tent. And Grandpa has smashed Pickle Boy's TV. Uh, Jesse smashed Psycho Dad's TV. Angry Grandpa has broken Jess, uh, Pickle Boy's PS4. Psycho Dad has broken Xboxes and other game consoles and stuff. Um, what else? Angry Grandpa gets mad and he yells and screams. Psycho Dad doesn't really scream, but he gets mad. There's a lot of similarities. Now you could say those are only a few and you're being a little too picky here. Okay. Okay. Maybe maybe I am being a little too picky. Maybe I'm, I, I'm thinking about this too much. But do you remember the video when Jesse called Pickle Boy and they talked? They talked on the phone for a good 15 minutes and they were discussing their dads and Jesse was explaining, oh my dad, he's always like this, he's always breaking my shit, I always gotta deal with him and it's hard just living with him. Pickle Boy replies, yeah, my dad's the same way, he does this, this and that, and it's the same shit. Now I'm pretty sure Pickle Boy and Jesse are friends and I'm pretty sure that they contact themselves, contact each other, and they give each other ideas to try to help out their channels. Because that's natural. Friends will want to help friends. But they're doing it in the wrong way. Because the Juggernuggets is fake. Anchor Grandpa and Kippy on the camera is fake. Now I'm pretty sure Jesse and Michael relay information back and forth to each other to try to see what will work and what will, what will earn them the most money. Because a lot of stuff that happens with Anchor Grandpa he just seems to get mad for no fucking reason. He just flies off the handle, which is good entertainment, but in the same instance, it's like, why the fuck are you getting mad so crazy? He's never used to be like this. And it's kind of like Psycho Dad. He gets mad in like the snap of his, I can't snap, but he gets mad like the snap of his fingers and just starts destroying shit for no reason. It's so similar in every way. And you guys could probably sit here and get mad at me, which you probably will, and say, well, they're just, it's just a little bit of stuff. You're, you're being too picky. Yeah, maybe I am being too picky. But Jesse and Michael are friends. And they talk to each other. Okay? They give each other ideas. And a lot of the stuff that's happened on both these channels is really similar in, in every way. It really is. I want you guys to go watch Anchor Grandpa. Go watch Majorganite Psycho Dad shit. Watch some of the videos. A lot of them are similar in every way. Um, Anchor Grandpa divorced his, his wife. Psycho Dad divorced his wife. Or she, the mom divorced the dad. But it's the same shit. Um, there's so many you can look at. Just go look at the Psycho Dad shit. And then go look at the Kid Behind the Camera shit. And the Anchor Grandpa shit. You will see that it's similar in every way. Why? I'm pretty sure Michael and Jesse talk to each other, give each other ideas like, Oh! Oh, Michael! Maybe your dad can go live out in a tent today because cause I did that and it seemed to be successful for me. It brought in lots of views, brought in lots of money. Oh! Jesse! Uh, maybe your dad can smash your, uh, your, your PS4 and your game consoles because my dad did that. He took my PS4 and, and, and he went on a scavenger hunt. I had to go on a scavenger hunt to find it. That could give you more views. You know what I mean? It just seems to be so similar in every way. And um, lo and behold, it's good entertainment on both these channels. I like to see Psycho Dad go crazy. I like to see Anchor Grandpa go crazy. But it's similar in every way. And both the channels are still fake to this day. Um, you guys can say all the shit you want, but it's still fake. Both these channels claim they don't have money when they do. Both these channels have dads that go crazy. And both these channels, their shit gets broken, but it seems like they, well, at least on Anchor Grandpa Show, their shit gets broken, and then they got new shit again because Michael bought him new stuff when they claim they don't have that much money. So Michael can just go buy new stuff all the time? It doesn't make any sense. If you guys still think this shit is real, 
please go to the hospital and get your brains checked because there's something wrong with you. There's really something wrong with you. Both these channels, all three of these channels, Kid Beyond the Camera, Angry Grandpa Show, and the Majorganogas channel, fake. 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 Just say that a couple times. It's fake. And I know I'm probably going to get a lot of heat for this, but I'm, I'm telling you, they are still fake. Still, and they'll always be fake until they actually come out and say, we're just doing this shit for entertainment. But they won't do that. And I'll tell you why they won't do that. They will not come out and say this was just for entertainment because they've been tricking everybody and giving off this persona that it's real. And people will be pissed and they'll unsub. Even though in the back of their minds, people might think, people probably know in the back of their minds that this is fake. But as soon as they come out and say, that it was fake, fans will unsub, and they know that. That's all I wanted to say, guys. Um, Anchor Grandpa, Kid on the Camera, and Majorga Nuggets, they're still fake. Still fake. And uh, you can say all the negative shit on me you want, and I'm not going to budge. That's my opinion. They're still fake, and you guys might think they're real, and I'm sorry to say if you still think they're real, oh my god, they are misleading you. They are... They're misleading you. That's all I gotta say. They're misleading you. And they're giving you false information because it's not real in one bit. It's not. And they're, they're both similar in every way. That's all I gotta say. I'll see you later.